Gone are those days when chemical sciences or chemistry professionals used to work in lab. Today, chemistry is more data driven than any other field. And thanks to computers, we have a new, emerging, exciting, more scopic field coming up for you. And that is called as chemi-informatics. Yes, you heard me right. Chemi-informatics is an interdisciplinary field that combines chemistry, computer science, and information technology, offering a wealth of career opportunities for all of you. If you're a chemistry professional who wants to create a global, diverse uh, chemistry career, then this is for you. If you want to get into pharmaceutical research, if you want to get into data analysis, if you're good in statistics, if you want to apply your knowledge of chemistry to discover new things faster, if you are impatient like me, then this field is for you and we popularly call it as chemi informatics. Now this will help us advance the chemical and scientific discovery in this world, in this information era. And that is why today's session is all about chemi informatics. So let's jump in and find out what is the foundational knowledge and what are the skill set you require as a chemistry professional to jump into the field of chemi informatics. Now of course you need some skill set extra that we'll look at later. The first thing you have to know is you need to have a solid understanding of chemistry, chemical concepts, chemical reactions, chemistry of uh, atoms, computational com chemistry, and that will form the foundation of cheminformatics for you. Now, at the same time, you should be able to comprehend various chemical theories, principles, and techniques which you will be using to tackle complex data-driven problems. Now, the second approach which you need to learn or you'll have to acquire is mathematical expertise. It's not that only chemistry is required, a bit of maths is also required. Now, if you are scared of maths, don't be, because when you start learning cheminformatics, it all starts coming automatically, and of course, you have computers to help you. So cheminformatics requires proficiency in various mathematical disciplines, such as graph theory, statistics, numerical analysis, and these skills will enable you to do effective analysis and modeling and interpretation of chemical data, leading to meaningful insights and problem solving. So my suggestion to you is mathematical, mathematical expertise can be acquired. It is a skill and not a knowledge base. Main knowledge base which you need, you already have that, and that is chemistry. Now followed with that, of, co of course, you will need computational and programming skills, and that is where Rasayanika comes into picture. We have Coding for Chemist initiative. We have Chemi Informatics internship for you where you can learn and acquire all of these skills and grow better in your career. Now, there are diverse career pathways of chemical informatics which you should know. Number one will be you can get into pharmaceutical and biotech companies. Now, why would these companies prefer you and they will create a role for you actually is because you will be able to save a billion dollars for them. Why? How? Well, you see this. If I have to, come to your house and say the same thing which I'm telling you right now, it'll cost me at least 10,000 rupees given, give or take how, in what part of the world you are, correct? But I'm able to digitally give you the, that same information. The same way, cheminformatics gives the same information about which molecule will work in this kind of a condition. So it'll be cheaper. The way my conversation you, with you is cheaper, the same way cheminformatics will be a cheaper way of doing research. So bio, biotech and pharmaceutical company will welcome you. The second is software and technology firms involved in cheminformatics. So for example, you use Microsoft Word or PowerPoint. What happens there? You are the end user, but somebody created that for you, correct? The same way molecular docking softwares, all these cheminformatics softwares are created by Schrodinger and various such companies. You can work there as a programmer and you can use your chemistry knowledge to enhance that. That is where, and it's a high paying job. And you, you have to know this, that a computer software engineer cannot learn chemistry, but a chemistry professional can always learn computer science. Computer is a skill, right? The third will be obviously academia and research institutions like CSIR labs, where you can go and do your research, become a scientist and work in the government, right? That's a great way. And now coming to the fourth is again, of, of course, Various emerging entrepreneurial opportunities are coming where you could start your own cheminformatics company. Isn't that great? So cheminformatics is a great, great, great field for all of you. And this requires continuous learning. This requires professional development. This requires ability to learn, unlearn, and relearn. This requires you to 
joint courses such as coding for chemist initiative by Rasayanika or the chem informatics internship at Rasayanika. You will have to be very good with networking in collaborating and you should be good in communication and you should have that lifelong learning approach. So if you have all of that, then a plethora of global opportunities are going to come your way on Rasayanika itself. So chem informatics has got worldwide, worldwide demand. And um, you, we are seeing international collaborations between universities and companies, companies and companies and labs and other labs. So this is where it is happening. And of course, you have to embrace this diversity. You have to be ready for it because I believe wherever two or three sciences merge together, that is where you can make a lot of money because others can't do that what you are capable of, right? So chem informatics is the future of life, uh, life sciences as well as chem chemical sciences. It is a data-driven uh, discovery approach. It is approach which drives innovation and it will impact sustainability and environmental effect it will have. And of course, it will further encourage and foster interdisciplinary research. So according to me, if you are someone who wants to do re research but at fast pace inside a computer like me, then you need to develop the chemi informatics mindset. You'll have to be curious. You have to be adaptable. You have to have an analytical thinking. You have to embrace in, uh, interdisciplinary collaboration and you need to have creative thinking and problem solving approach. If you can learn all of that, then chem informatics is the place to be in. Chem informatics is the place which will take you forward and chem informatics is the field which will become your bread and butter of the future. So what are you waiting for? Let me know in the comment section what you think. And if you want to join Coding for Chemist or Chem, Chem Informatics Internship at Rasainika, link in the description. See you soon in the next one. Till then, keep shining. Bye-bye.